Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Today what I'm going to show you is my creamy Italian chicken. You can serve it over rice or noodles. I'm choosing to serve it over uh, egg noodles. So the first thing that I did is I pounded three chicken breasts. So now I'll salt, pepper. I'll place the chicken in my crock pot, salt and pepper side down. So I'll do the same to the other two chicken breasts. Salt and pepper and then place it salt and pepper side down. One more. You'll cook this on high for about three hours or until a chicken is fully cooked. Now I'll get rid of this. Now on top of my chicken, what I'm going to use is one packet of the Italian dressing. I'll open it up and then sprinkle it on top of your chicken breasts. You want to make sure it's really coated well. So I have the seasoning packet on top of my three chicken breasts. That's what it looks like. To this I'll add in a third of a cup of white wine. This is the white wine that I'm using. So I'll add in a third of a cup and that's it for this chicken. I'll pour the white wine in. Put my lid on and turn my crock pot on high. This is optional. This is optional. I have eight green onions. What I'll do is I'll slice them and then I'll place them in my crock pot. You don't have to. Take the ends off. So now I'll place the onions on top. And like I said, let this cook this for about three hours on high or until your chicken is fully cooked. For the sauce for my creamy Italian chicken, I'll take one can, which is one pound, 10 ounces. It's a 26 ounce can of cream of mushroom soup. I'll place it in my pan. So I'll take my spatula and get all the soup out of the can. I'll turn my burner on medium low. To this I'm going to add in 8 ounces of cream cheese. So I'll place the cream cheese in with the cream of mushroom soup. Get 
To my cream of mushroom soup and cream cheese, I have 10 ounces of the white mushrooms. I'll quarter them and then I'll fold them into the cream of mushroom soup with the cream cheese. This creamy Italian chicken is really good. Nice big one. Another big one. Now they're all quartered. I'll check on my sauce. The cream cheese is melted into the cream of mushroom soup. So as soon as the cream cheese is fully melted, that's when I'll add in the mushrooms that I just quartered. To my cream of mushroom soup and my eight ounces of cream cheese, I'm just gonna add in about a third of a cup of the white wine that I put inside my crock pot. So I'll just eyeball it. I poured it in the can to get the rest of the cream and mushroom soup out. I'll pour it in. And then just mix it around. Oh yeah. So now I'll take my mushrooms that I quartered, I'll add them in. Just fold them into the sauce. Perfect. I'll put the lid on. For my side dish, I have one pound of fresh green beans that I'll go rinse. To this, I'll be adding in one shallot. So I'll go wash my green beans. All my green beans are washed, so I'll place it off to the side. I'll take one shallot. Peel the skin off. I'll slice them up thin. And then I'll slice them into little pieces. That's perfect. In my frying pan, I placed a little bit of olive oil. I'll take my shallot, place it in my frying pan. While that's cooking, then I'll cut my green beans. So I'll cut the ends of the green beans off. Kind of line them all up. Come on. These green beans are really good. What I'll do is add in a pad of butter once they start cooking. Salt and pepper. And this will be the side dish for my creamy Italian chicken. 
I can really smell the chicken. It smells good. Down to the last few. Nothing like fresh green beans. Okay, this is the last of them. Now I'll place them back in my strainer to put them in my frying pan. Don't they look good? My shallot has browned up beautifully. So now I'll place my green beans in. Add a little salt, a little pepper, I'll add in a little pad of butter. Let the butter melt on top. I have my burner on low. I'll place my lid on. Let that finish cooking. Now I'll check on my sauce. Ooh, looks good. Mix that cream cheese in. Perfect. And like I said, you can serve this over rice or egg noodles. I happen to be using egg noodles. noodles and your rice according to the directions on the box or package. So now I'll check on my green beans. Oh, looking good. I'll try one to make sure it's nice and tender. Just the way I like it. It's good. I'll turn my burner off. Add a little bit more salt. A little bit more pepper. Just leave the lid on it. I'm waiting for my chicken to get done. Once my chicken is done, then I'll serve it up. Now I'll check on my chicken. Oh, it's coming along good. Yeah, looking good. I'll flip the chicken over. Yeah, smells good. So now I'll let it finish cooking. My sauce is looking good. I just started my water for my noodles. I'm using a one pound package and I'll cook it according to the directions on the box. Once my noodles are done, then I'll drain them. I'll combine it with the sauce and the chicken, have the side dish of my green beans, and my dinner is done. So now I'll check on my green beans. They look good. They smell good. Mm -mm -mm. Perfect. I'll check on my chicken. Ooh, it's looking good. It smells good. Look at how good that chicken came out. So now I'm just waiting for my noodles and then my dinner will be done. Really smells good. My water is boiling so I'll add in some salt. I'll open up the package of my egg noodles.
My noodles are done, so now I'll go drain them. I'll take them off my burner. So my noodles are drained. I'll take my sauce, combine it into my noodles. Mix the sauce with the egg noodles so that the egg noodles are all coated. I'll try a bite. Mm -mm -mm, perfect. I'll check on my chicken. Oh yeah, look at how good that looks. Really smells good. You can also add a little bit of this gravy to your sauce so that your sauce isn't as thick as I have it. So now I'll turn my crock pot off. I'll go get a plate. Now doesn't this look good? And this is my creamy Italian chicken with my side dish of green beans. Can't wait to dig in. So now I'll try a bite. Take a piece of the chicken with some of the noodles and mushroom. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Well, this is good. Take another bite. Mm-mm. Look at how nice these green beans came out. It's perfect. Mm-mm-mm. Really, really good. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. And watch me make my creamy Italian chicken. It's really good. Enjoy. I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>